I just parked miles away from where I'm actually meeting Guy because I thought I'd better nab this parking space really fast because it's Sunday and everyone will probably be parking in town but I <laughs> see I see him, you're gonna love this site. But actually there's loads of parking everywhere. <laughs> I guess no one's awake yet. <laughs> Hold on, look at this. Oh, wait, I need these cu this couple to move and then we can just see this site. <laughs> you okay there? <laughs> morning, <laughs> morning chaps. <laughs> Suits you, the bike look. You look very chic. You know, you're riding on the pink. Oh God. <laughs> I almost knocked that person over. <laughs> Not meant for town life, this guy. <laughs> Why is this so amusing? Why is watching Guy ride a bike through London music? I don't know if you're allowed to ride on the pavement. Here we go, our first Sunday brunch at Annabelle's. Guy is looking very Guy at the moment. Very serious about her steak. Obviously, so boring, got a Caesar salad. Multiple sides. This is literally a giant mouse. You know it's a weekend when you're walking like Sir Nail Pace. Now we are walking in a brisk stroll. <laughs> He's making fun of me because I said about us walking in a slow pace and he was like, in great content. Yeah, that's super, um, super interesting. <laughs> uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Riveting. Riveting, Riveting yes. content. Wow, tell us more about how, how quickly or slowly you're walking. <laughs> wow. That's, yeah, you guys, maybe you should do like, ask me a question on Instagram. <laughs> should we walk quicker? <laughs> should we walk slower? One of those things with the slider. But yeah, fast. too fast, too slow, you tell us. Ooh, who knows? Uh, do I find you too funny? Yes. Me, me. Yeah. I know. Someone commented the other day that I'm really easily amused. Really? Yeah. Would you agree? I think. Uh, I... No. I, well, it can what? go either way. Like sometimes you're really easily amused, sometimes you're not amused at all. I see. Yeah. Like your like content today has been unamusing. <laughs> About the pace of my walk. <laughs> just, just, just. We are going through a nice, having a nice casual Sunday stroll. Being insulted by me. Being insulted by guy. What else is new? Actually, I don't find you insulting. You me? Yeah, oh god, so no. Nice. No, you're so bounced. No. Unless I start walking fast. Oh. <laughs> what? Bye. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the plot thickens. <laughs> <laughs> you thought we would have drunk something at lunch, and we actually haven't. I had two cokes there. You did have two cokes. Oh, yeah, I had a hot water and lemon because I really live it up these days, Sunday brunch style. So. Look at my beautiful daffodils. It is officially spring when daffodils come out, I think, and they look so happy. I love how beautiful they are. They're so yellow. John's kindly filming my outfit tonight because we still don't have a full in here in the flat. And I can't talk about it because I might cry. Anyway, <laughs> wearing this dress, I oh, <laughs> Ronnie Kobo and those black little boots. Oh my gosh, they've set this up like a home. It is so beautiful in here. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. Having a little photo shoot. Oh, good pose. Good pose. Good pose. <laughs> Going through the little flower tunnel, there's sort of everything. There's even flowers on the ceiling. This is insane. Look how amazing this is. Christian Dior have basically made every room a giant Maison Christian Dior room full of flowers and everything. I mean, this is beyond insane. This is crazy. Every single room is different and beautiful. Just got back from the event. I was given this gorgeous goodie bag. Let's have a look what is inside. I love the Maison Christian Dior range. Ooh, this is Holy Peony. And when we went into the peony room tonight, it smelled absolutely beyond 
So I'm opening this with my wrong hand. Oh, look at that beautiful bottle with the CD on the lid. The lid's actually magnetic. Oh, I love that feature. Look how great that is, so satisfying. I have one word to describe what's going down today and that is shoes, shoesy shoes, shoes. We are going to make some shoes. I'm sorry, does life get better than making shoes on a Wednesday? No, it doesn't. I really don't. I'm, anyway, not getting excited until we're there. <laughs> That's a lie. I've been excited since we had this in the diary. But I actually wanted to show you my outfit. I just bought these pearl hair clips on Etsy. I'll put a link to them down below to the seller because they're really quite sweet and I like how they match and go together. I think they're around six pounds if I remember correctly. I wanted to get the Zara ones but I saw they sold out. I thought it was better to support an independent retailer than Zara also on Etsy. So outfit of the day, I am wearing something a little bit different for me today. These jeans which are actually from Paige and they are so comfortable. This is like me in a jean. I just want to wear track suits and this is perfect. So I'm wearing this H&M cozy jumper. I wish they had it in other colors because it is honestly one of my favorite jumpers I wear all the time. Cracked out an old favorite of mine, this orange Valentino bag. And yeah, Paige denim jeans and my Chanel shoes. I'm not even wearing a coat today because it is so sunny. Just got in the car with Liv and she has bought me the best gift ever. What is this? Are you, no, but I mean, can I just tell you what it looks like? <laughs> Do you know what this looks like? <laughs> this looks like two ovaries. It could be a pelican, like there's the nose and there's the eyes. It could be two ovaries, you know? But it is, not, oh, not I haven't actually either. said what it is. It is a butt seat thing for spinning because I went spinning yesterday and then I was just moaning to live this morning that I was in so much pain. Anyway, we're going to go, oh, come on, come on, I'm not going. Okay, I'm sorry, oh my God, I am my mum. I'm actually my mum, I just did a total my mum. This is why I don't drive my mum. Okay, sorry, I'm not commenting ever again. You know that moment in Friends? I think I've mentioned this on my vlog before. And she was like, I was trying so hard not to be my mother. I didn't see this coming. I've been trying so hard not to be my mother. I did not see this coming. She's like a father. Oh dear. Okay, help me. Oh my gosh, we just walked in and we're already have no words. In excitement. I have like a slip down the back and my shoes will still show and then I have another dress that's shorter. So ideally something that I can wear with both of them. Is this for the engagement? Or this is for the engagement okay. party, yeah. Okay. I don't have a wedding dress yet. Okay. <laughs> but also I'll be dancing so something that will actually hold my feet. Okay, okay, lovely. All right, I'll go and get a few bits to get us started. Okay. Cool. Feel free to have a look around. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> these are beautiful. Look at these. Look at the detail. I'd love to wear something like this in white, but I feel like I'd be, I jump a lot when I dance. <laughs> so I'm not sure if that would work. Wow. Oh, they have a little stone at the back. That's so cute. Oh mm. my God. Look how beautiful these are. So much detail goes into them. These are the faces of everyone wondering if I'm wearing the right size right now. Because they still, feel, I've sized down, but they still feel a tiny bit big. They look so pretty, even just like this. Love them. Embellished or plain. Embellished. Plain. So okay. all of these little crystals here, yeah. they could all be changed to black crystals. So you've just oh, got that a little... Oh, that's so clever. Because I said, there's a bit of black in my dress. How can we incorporate that into the shoe? That is such a good idea. So it would be these ones in the center. Yeah, exactly. Anything classic. Oh, oh that God, is I so love. clever. And the crystal would be black or just the claws? It'll be yeah, the crystal. crystals. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's so clever. taking it to Instagram. When in doubt. <laughs> so we have done my engagement party shoe. We're gonna get them engraved. We're gonna have our birthstones on them. It's, I'm so excited. They're gonna be so, so cute. Also, as you know, Liv is getting married this summer. Oh my God, you're engaged. You're engaged. <laughs> uh, I don't know if people are in on that private joke though. <laughs> joke now. When she got engaged, basically, just to explain to anyone, it was public knowledge 
even people that didn't know you know knew that you were engaged yeah <laughs> no my friend, yeah no yeah i'm sorry you, you say that yourself me. i was worse than you that's why i couldn't i can't really make fun of you about it anymore which is a shame people have actually commented on that that i can't make fun of you anymore anyway she's getting married this summer so we're also gonna sort her wedding shoes today okay go okay then this is pressure oh sorry <laughs> <laughs> so excited okay. Where are your toes? <laughs> Where are they? I've literally <laughs> never been happier that I had a pedicure last week. But I actually Winter. had such gross toes before then. Yeah, yeah exactly. No one's seeing my toes. Don't look Oh my gosh, they're like carry shoes. <gasps> These are. Oh my gosh, they're stunning. These are so beautiful. <laughs> Why am I whispering around the shoes? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Bye. 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 City on lockdown. Lockdown. <laughs> with the little rat. Little rat. Am I doing it right? Am I doing it right? I'm definitely doing it right. Don't worry about you. wedding dress. Oh, she got distracted. Oh, I just recorded that. Good. That was. <laughs> Driving up <laughs> Kansas in your car. You have actually a decent voice. You want a sign. You are. To sing no, this, is the the best best bit. this is the best bit. Don't ruin it. After dark, after dark, city on lockdown. Lockdown. You're not good enough for my back and vocals. <laughs> um, genuinely, if you yeah. want, yeah. as my wedding gift to you, yeah, I'm prepared to sing your first dance. <laughs> oh my god. I know. I didn't do it for many people. <laughs> <laughs> when I was at when I was at uni, yeah. I studied theatre, so a yeah. lot of people just assumed I could sing because most people on my course did musical theatre, but yeah. I actually did theatre therapy. Anyway, this girl called me and she was like, "Nev, I'm doing this charity event, and our singers pulled out. Would you mind doing it?" I was like, "Oh my god, of course! Like, thanks so much. Of course, I'm more than happy to help out the charity." And then my friend's like, "You really should tell her that you're tone deaf." <laughs> and I was like, "She didn't ask me. I can sing, just not well." <laughs> She didn't find it funny. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what did you actually end up saying? No, it? of course not. I'm totally We're actually right next door to where Duke gets his haircuts. So we're going. I'm really to excited to see this. He's going to be all flat. Has he got like a really cute. glam? Yeah, he, he um, they puff him up. <laughs> it's really cute. Oh, she's done well. Oh, I have a great haircut. My haircut looks so good. I am so fluffy. Today is not a normal Friday because, very exciting, I'm doing a, sorry, I look a bit like a ghost because I've fake tanned and it goes over my lip and it looks a bit funny, but I'm doing a makeup trial with the wonderful Nelson Hi, from Charlotte Tilbury and we are literally setting up right now, I say we, it's him, <laughs> setting up all his exciting things. He has like a suitcase of dreams over there full of Charlotte Tilbury things. He walked in with a backpack, which was somewhere here, like a little backpack, and I was like, where's the giant suitcase? And it was like in the hallway. <laughs> it's like giant suitcase, you can put someone in. And now we're gonna start. And I actually need to talk you through what I had an idea, and then maybe you can tell me yeah. what you mm -hmm. think of what I think. <laughs> I kind of wanted something obviously smoky. Dolce Vita is like my favorite palette. It's the one I use all the time when I go out. And I like something with like a lot of lift and like a feline kind of eye, which is obviously the Charlotte Tilbury thing. And a lot of like lashes, sure, glowy, bit, yeah, like, like glam. And I love like the bronzies, like bet eyes to mesmerize. I love that color. Like those kind of like bronzy golden shades. What do you think? Like the star golden. Yeah. Eyes to yeah, yeah, also yeah. quite good with the rose gold yeah. and the stars in her eyes palette. Yeah. That, that's that's kind of, you can kind of like mix and match a little bit yeah. with uh, Dolce Vita, I exactly. think it would be quite good. Because <gasps> if you're already wearing Dolce Vita quite often, yeah. for you. Yeah, you exactly. Wanna, I don't want to look like it's my normal Saturday night smoky so eye. Like, it's yeah. a little like twist, so I okay. think it would be great. Okay. Yeah. okay, cool. Yeah, I wanted to say that actually because that's like the Dolce Vita is like my normal palette that I use, but I didn't want to like, have, have some 
lurkers here waiting to see the makeup look. We haven't even started. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wanted to kind of like up it a little bit, do something a bit different, but still my look basically. This is the best way to do like a tutorial for yourself. Yeah, I know you're like quite firm with the skin. Yeah, because it's good to like make the rim go into the skin a little bit. Yeah. Otherwise if you just do like yeah, that, it, it, it stays the oil stays on top yeah. of the skin, it doesn't really go in. And then it makes all the makeup almost like slide. I love Wonder Glow. You know what? I, use that. I have I got Wonder Glow when it first launched and then I kind of forgot about it because of magic because cream. I love but on Wonder top Glow. of magic cream it I looks amazing. amazing. I never got on with the contour one. I know, so many people are quite I scared. I never to got on with that. I gave it to my sister. She was like, she kind of uses it sometimes. This looks so nice. I'd never apply straight into the skin. I always put okay, on my hand. On and your then I use this one. It looks so natural. This is nice. Oh my god, this for me is my favorite. And then you can go over with the film star. Yeah, because mm. I normally go straight to film star bronze and burn. I like to do this first. It gives okay. a nice glow. This is and happening. And then if you want, you can yeah. use the little bit of like a shadow. Yeah. yeah. If you have just one style, how can you cater to like this? Yeah. <laughs> You know? Yeah, it makes sense. It, it makes is total possible. Sense. It's po some people just do like one type. Yeah. It's special sense. when you go to Essex. They're just like the monobrow so and all beautiful. that look. But I'm actually crying. This makeup, this is so pretty. You don't cry. But there's so many things you can do. <laughs> the makeup station. Let's say around halfway through. Halfway, halfway through, through, Nelson? Yeah, we're yeah. Halfway okay. Through. Yeah, of course. Because <laughs> you're gonna not want to be associated with my lips when I overlap. <laughs> I actually you, draw, like, you, I draw on a whole new lip. Are you like Charlotte? Does she draw overline her lips? Yeah. I do mine more. I literally <laughs> like hold on. I draw on like a whole other. This is pillow talk right here. Yeah. I used to do it as when I sometimes I used to do a makeup at the beginning and the yeah. she always just say no darling. Really? So, <laughs> let, me do, let me do it. Because <laughs> sometimes you don't know it ends, but now I just go for it and she always goes, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah. More, you go for it more than that? I draw on a hole. Yeah, you go a little bit over. under or over mm. your uh, liner shape just to like balance a little bit. But now I can't see my lips without it. It's got to that stage. Because you get so used to see that, mm -hmm. and it just becomes unnatural not to have it. Mm -hmm. Like we oh, literally oh. made the lip liner blunt <laughs> from one application. And if you use pillow top with pencil, then it's so easy, and it looks mm -hmm. almost looks like it looks natural. natural. You can fix the shape. I can of fix the shape. <laughs> <laughs> so there are some new glasses that we're going to use today. This is Studio 64. That is a cool color. This mm -hmm. is Bette du Soir. Oh, it's pigmented. Yeah, this is a cool on. Is it? Oh my god, I feel like my lips just tripled in size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. That's amazing. You know what, of all the Pillow Talk products, 
think the blush is my least favorite. Mm -hmm. But whenever I put it on, I love it. So I feel bad saying that because look how juicy it just made the apples on my cheeks look. It mm -hmm. really makes such a difference to the face. Mm -hmm. But I love it. But I feel like I love the eyeshadow more than I love the blush. <laughs> and I love the lip liner more than I love the eyeshadow. So that's why the blush is my least. And it's probably because you don't really use blushes very often. Like yeah. Pen, yeah. But I mean, look at the apples on my cheeks. It just makes. It's nice when you have like a full on eye and everything because it makes yeah. it look really pretty. But sometimes when you just have a I bit of lip that. liner. I love that Hollywood light wand. It's so I've literally never looked like this. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend like I haven't looked in the mirror this entire time. <laughs> Who's gonna do <leave> that? <laughs> Oh, this is a oh my gosh, I love it so much. Wow, I love it. This is like my dream smoky eye. Just like catty and lift with the nude lip and the glowing skin. And because underneath is not too heavy, it yeah. looks like pretty. Yeah. Thank you, it's I beautiful. love it. Thank, Thank you. you so you much. Love pleasure. <gasps> I don't want to wash my face. No, you don't. <laughs> Wow, oh my gosh, I can't stop staring at it. My skin looks so nice. Can you see how the light just catches that? That pillow top blush makes such a difference. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you guys can get a better look of my makeup. I'm kind of like in the dark with these fancy lights on and I just put on this little hair clip uh, which actually matches my earrings which so many people have commented on actually. I think maybe I would wear a darker lip than this. I feel like this might be a bit too nude. Can you let me know what you think in the comments? I feel like you guys always have really good recommendations and also these lights are making me look really muscly. Look at that. Ugh, ugh. <laughs> Don't like my arms. I <laughs> Don't like muscly arms. <laughs> Everyone else I feel like loves getting muscly arms but i was born with mine i don't like them <laughs> actually i just went upstairs to grab something because let me sit back in my light setup the guys at Chart tilbury very very kindly gave me one two three four things to give away to you which is amazing and i feel like so excited because especially when they showed me this kit this is actually called the party girl kit and it includes like all the things that I use on a daily basis. This color chameleon, I love, it's my favorite shade. Pillow Talk lip liner, obviously, a mini lipstick. I mean, how cute is that? Black eyeliner, which is the one I'm wearing now, and legendary lashes, which is also what I'm wearing now. So I have two of these to give away, and also two of these Glowing Skin Pretty palette, which I, as you know, was traveling with the whole of this I think it was summer when it came out. And it has like bronzer, highlighter, three blush shades. Okay, so we're gonna team it up and do two giveaways, one of each. And one I'm gonna do on Instagram and one I'm gonna do on the newsletter because I always get requests to not do them on Instagram, but I can't actually do them on YouTube. It's like technically YouTube illegal or something. So the one on Instagram, all you have to do is follow me on Instagram. My username is at Amelia Liana. Go and comment on my latest picture and use the hashtag Amelia Liana vlogs. And then the other giveaway will be to subscribe to my newsletter on my blog so if you go onto my blog it should give you a little thing saying do you want to subscribe to my newsletter it goes out every two weeks with more like a diary update and we will pick someone at random from the recent email subscribers because we can see all your emails and you will get an email from me the giveaway is open internationally as always and i hope that is exciting for you guys because it's really exciting for me to be able to share my love for charlotte tilbury with you i'm gonna end the vlog here i'm probably just gonna stare at my makeup all evening <laughs> so we'll see you on wednesday Wednesday with another video. Mwah. Bye guys!